ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to Sky Factory 2. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed that first episode. It was very, very much fun making that first episode. I have missed Sky Factory incredibly. But uh, today, we got a couple of things that we want to work on, and the first thing that we're going to work on is this. Look at this. So we're at 165. We need to go to 166 to level that up, so we're going to do that right now. First things first, get all these leaves and get some get as many saplings as we can get. And then BAM! What do we get? Uh so what does it have now? It has reinforced. Well, that's better than nothing. So at least now it's not gonna break on us as easy. That's good. Oh, there we go. Alright, so um now we've also done whoops, we've also done a few other things. We got some sand right here. Uh, and if you remember at the last of the, at the end of the last episode, we uh, needed to... Ooh, oh, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, we want to break this. We want to sift this, because we haven't sifted sand yet. We got gravel and we got dust, but we hadn't sifted sand yet. So let's get this going through here. Boom. And... Oh, I feel gypped again. What did we get? We got uh, crushed iron. Okay. Anyway, we can come over here. And we can go to this spot right here. Sift gravel, sand, and dust into a sieve. Sure. Done. Uh, make clay by putting dust into a water-filled barrel. All right. Let's see. Can we do that real quick? I believe we can. Uh, we need some sand. Do I have some... Do I not have any... Uh... I have dirt. I can get cobble. So let's do that. Let's get some cobble real quick. Oh, I got dirt right there too. Good. Let's see how much uh, how much stone did we get? Four. Good. That's perfect. Oh, dang it! Pick that back up, will you? Sheesh. Okay. So now we'll break this and turn it into dust. Okay. Cool. And sand. And dust. Put the dust into here. And clay. Love it. Okay, so now we can cross that off. So uh, We'll have to do that some more. So I'm going to have to get some, some more leaves going so I can make some more dirt. Uh, that way we can get some more, some more cobble so we can turn it into dust. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'll be back with you guys here shortly. But uh, today, the other big thing that we're going to be working on is getting the hostile mob farm going. Hostile mob farm is going to give us a lot more things to use than the passive mob farm will. Uh, passive mob farm is important for food, but I got tons of apples, so I think I'm okay on food for now. But the hostile mob farm is going to give us like zombie flesh, and you can compost zombie flesh. So uh, and that'll help get us more dirt. So that's going to be kind of important to get done. All right, so anyway, going to get going on more leaves, and we're going to get some... Uh, uh, we're going to get some cobblestone out of that, pulverize it down, turn it into dirt, make more, uh, make more clay, and then when we get more clay going, then we can, uh, then we can make this crucible, and we can actually start making lava, uh, and also we can also get some other stuff done. So give me just a minute, and we'll take care of that, and we'll be right back with you. Almost forgot this. Um, we were able to get from our, uh, from our sifting of dirt. We were able to get grass seed, so we're going to go ahead and put this down right there. So now we got grass blocks, and so we can start tacking grass blocks on going all the way out to the passive mob farm, and then we'll have grass growing. So, yeah, I wanted to show you that so that you guys didn't think I was cheating or anything, you know. Um, we got a couple more of them in here, too. We can actually do that a couple of times. We also got pumpkin seeds and melon seeds and carrot seeds, so we can get ourselves a pretty good farm going when the time comes, too. So, anyway, we will see you in a minute with stuff to do other things. So, see ya soon. Be back. I know, I'm rambling. Ah, yes, all these trees. Ugh, I have cut down a lot of wood, dudes. And dudettes. Uh, lots and lots of wood. We've got, uh, what, one, two, what, six, uh, yes, yeah, almost seven stacks of wood. That's pretty good. Um, I am... Oh yeah, okay, good. I can plant another tree here. All right, so I changed my mind a little bit. I said we were going to work on the mob farm today. I don't think we're going to get to that today because what I want to do is I want to I want to fire I want to get one of these crucibles going. That way we can uh, uh, that way we can make lava. So let's take uh, let's take a couple of pieces of cobblestone 
and plop those down here someplace where we can actually hit them. Oh, I got another piece. Okay, we'll do three pieces then. Uh, and let's get these broke down into dust because in because du we can use the dust to make uh, <coughs> use the dust to make um, sand or not sand but uh, clay. So we'll get these popped down into dust real quick. There's the sand and boom, 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 and make it into dust. Um, bloop, and e. yeah, yeah, there's a, yep, yeah, had to do that because if we don't, then yeah, things are not going to work out very well. But if we do this and this, then we should get, uh, ooh, wait a minute, ooh, wait a minute, um, Crucible, unfired. That's porcelain clay. I gotta have bone meal. Oh, you stink! You absolutely stink. Sorry if that made any noise. I had to adjust the boom on my microphone. So we are gonna have to do the uh, the mob spawner here real quick. All right. Well, let's look at it. Let's do this. Let's put that in there and put that in there. Uh, we'll put the dust. Yeah, sure. We'll put the dust in there too. Let's grab some wood. Uh, yeah, we need we need wood, lots of wood. Okay, and let's get ourselves some planks, and let's get ourselves some slabs. We have to go out 25 blocks, so let's go over here, and so that's gonna we'll count that as we won't count that as one. So one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yes, folks, I can count. Twenty-one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, buddy. All right. Now, how wide do I want to make this? Let's go. Let's go five in each direction. So, uh, one, two, three, four. Five. Come back this way, and we'll go five in this direction. Okay, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now, now we need to make this a little bit wider. Just so I've got a place to work here. And then this needs to be spawnable surfaces. Okay. And let's put some torches down out here so nothing spawns until I'm ready for it to. Now let's go down this way, just like so. Boom, boom, boom. And work our way around this way, like so. There we go. And then come down around the other end. Like this. Now the key here is to make it so that we can see the mobs, but they can't see us. Because if they see us, then of course, then the, uh, the creepers will explode and that will be a... That'll be a whole big, bad, nasty thing. Um, now, I think I'm going to have to actually go a little bit higher here. Because um, if I, let's see, if I do this, if I go up here like so, yeah, I could probably, uh, maybe, I don't know. Let's see, let's go this way. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to see... I wouldn't be able to see the mob, so I'm going to have to have the spawnable surface here, I think. Okay, so we're going to have to do some more work here. Boop. Okay. And then make that spawnable, make that spawnable, make that spawnable. Eh. There we go. Okay. 
There we go. That'll be that'll make it better. Now let's go right there. Perfect. Oh, that's not so perfect because now we can't get back up there. Darn it. Let's do that. That'll make it better. All right. Now come over here and let's go up a full block and then come down. Oh, don't lose those. Whew. There we go. And if we go right here like this, now we can do this like so. Uh huh. And like that. And like that. And that. Uh, we don't want to put one there just yet because I want to be able to get in and out of here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and light this up. And then I think I'm going to go and, well, I don't need to sleep. There's no reason to sleep. We'll just, we'll just do this. We'll just do this. How about that? So there, there, there. Um, yep, leave that open. Okay. All right. Now I just need to build this up, turn it into a box. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And uh, when I come back, we should have ourselves a, uh, a living, breathing structure capable of spawning, mo uh, spawning mobs. So I'll see you momentarily. take a look at it here from back over here real quick and yep there it is now we just got to get the lights out of there get the torches out of there and we should start getting mobs so let's make that go away and let's make that go away and let's go over here and see what we can see hopefully this will work for us uh, I think we know what this is we can take that away all right, do we see anything out there yet? Nope, not yet. You know, we'll just give it a minute. I got to make this wider. Oh, yep, there's one right there. All right, now what do we got for a sword? We don't have a sword, do we? All right, let's make ourselves a little sword here and go up there and see if we can't uh, see if we can't do something. You know what? Let's do a let's do this. I guess we'll do a stone, a stone sword. And then let's go out there and see if we can't kill something. Now we got to be careful out here because we could fall off to our demise. Let's see, that looks like a zombie. Oh, and there's a skeleton too, so let's go down here and get the skeleton first. Yes, we got it. All right. And then we'll get the zombie. And what did we get from him? If we got some, yeah, so we're going to get tons of rotten flesh. We're going to get this Manikio essence and everything. So that's going to be awesome. All right. So I'm going to go AFK for a little bit and see if we can't get some, uh, some more mobs spawning in this thing. And uh, when we come back, we will see where we're at. So see you guys here shortly. <laughs> Oh, 
here. Okay, folks. The mob farm is working out pretty well. Don't have a lot of stuff in my inventory right now except for my uh, loot bags. But, uh, oh, and we just leveled up again. Cool. What do we got now? Beheading. Awesome. Sharpness. Reinforce 2. Haste. Oh, this is awesome. So, and we can pretty much kill anything we want in about two hits, with the exception of Enderman. We got some Ender Pearls, some heads. Oh, this is doing awesome. We're doing well. So, let's take a look down here. I put a chest down here to, uh, to hold all of the loot that I couldn't hold anymore. So, let's take a look and see what we got in here. So, we'll put that in there, put that in there, and uh, so that Manicchio in there. Okay, so that's all the stuff that we've gotten off of the mobs. I got tons of zombie flesh too. I've been using that as compost over there. Uh, but let's take a look in some of these loot bags and see what we get. So this one here, we get an iron pick. We got some oak saplings. We got a music disc. We got this jailer safari net. Cool. Uh, in this one here, another ender pearl. Take that. Thank you. Uh, another ender pearl. We got some inscriber stuff. Uh, logic press and a. Oh, we got some wheat. Cool. What's in here? Uh, an iron sword. Awesome. Some obsidian. That's helpful. Overgrowth seed. Okay. What do we got in here? Gold. And vibrant alloy. Some more oak saplings. Oof. We're doing good here, folks. Oh, yeah. Um, might take the boots. I don't know. Let's see. Another iron sword. Let's uh, put this down here, and put this down here, and put this one down here, and that'll be the all, that'll be all of them. So in this one, we got some. Oh, we got a bucket! <gasps> got a bucket. I don't have to make one. Yay! Cool. Got the inscriber press, uh, the um, the silicon press right there. Cool. Got bread. Okay. What do we got in here? Electrical steel, dark steel, and an ender. And what do we got in here? We got melon seeds, we got a lotus plant, and an iron ingot. Cool. All right, so now we'll go ahead and put these other. Oh, they're not all going to fit, are they? Whew. Okay. Well, that's all right. We'll take these ender pearls out of here. We'll take some bones out of here. And then we should have room for all these bags. There we go. And then we'll put this stuff over here into my other chest. Um, let's see here. I should have a spot for those. I should have a spot for those. Whoa, okay, so that's Batania. Uh, we got Ender Pearls, awesome. Okay, so Mob Farm, success. All right, now, what were we going to do next? Well, we were going to take this bone and turn it into a bone meal. We're going to need, we don't need all of that, but that's okay. Uh, then we need to get this clay because now we need to make our crucible. So we need to put that in there like that, and that in there, whoops, and that in there like that. Um, we only need seven. Yeah, we only need seven. We don't need more than that. So, all right. So then we need to take this and do like this. Sweet. Put it into the furnace here, yeah, like so. What do I have that I can cook that with? Coal. I have coal. I have charcoal. We made some charcoal, so we'll use that up. Oh, you can't shift click it. That sucks. Okay, so we'll let that go, and then we got to figure out where we're going to put it. And I think that's probably going to just about uh, wrap up today's episode. Um, I don't want to get too far involved. I think I've got everything I'm going to need to build the uh, cobblestone generator, which I think is the next thing on the list after we get the, uh, the crucible all built up. Uh, let's see here. So we're going to craft and cook a crucible, heat the crucible with a torch, and then make stone into... Uh, into lava, so we're going to do that here in just a minute, and then we're going to build a cobblestone generator, so we'll probably do the cobblestone generator in next episode, because I want to be able to give it enough time that uh, that it's worth it. Okay, there we go. Crucible. Now, where's my torches? Torches are right there. Okay. Now, where do I want to put said a crucible? Hmm. How about... How about... How about right here? Because what we can do is if we do this, oh, yeah, poop, and we go like this, then we can put the crucible on top of it like so. Yeah. Oh, hey, we didn't lose the, we didn't lose the slab. Cool. All right, now let's get some of this cobblestone. I think it holds, I don't know how many it holds. We'll just go until it tells us to stop. 
There we go. Alright, so now we are... Yeah! We got 12 millibuckets of lava in there now. That's pretty good. I think we're okay. So we'll put this back in here. Uh, I'll, I'll keep tending it and make sure that we get an entire bucket of lava. Uh, but the other thing that we can do now is now that we have a bucket, we can, we can make ourselves a, a water supply. So where do we want to put a water supply? How about, let's get some more slabs. Uh, yep, yeah, that should be enough, I think. Let's go over here. And we'll just go like that. Uh, uh -huh. We're going to need more than that, aren't we? Because the bucket, the water's going to want to sit up here at this level. Mm hmm. Yep, we're going to need to do more than that. So let's get a couple more slabs. Let's make a couple more slabs. There we go. And slabaroonies. And boop, boop, boop. Now we can do it. Now we can get it. So, water. And water. And then one more over here. Water. And that'll make this a totally, totally, totally infinite water source. Love it. Okay, so now, how's this lava doing here? Uh, 212 millibuckets. Let's get ourselves some more cobblestone. Let's see. Um, let's make... I'm going to do the cobblestone generator out of slabs, so let's go ahead and, and do the slabs that we're going to need to make that happen. I need... Uh, by my calculations, I need a little, oh, I need like 31, so. Uh -huh. Okay, so that should get me everything that I need. Yeah, that should get me everything I need for the cobblestone generator. Can't do anything else with that. Okay, well, let's go down here and see what kind of mobs we got, and then I think we'll call it a day. How about that, folks? We should have a few mobs down here. Oh, we only have one. That's okay, we'll kill him. You're dead, and I got a head. Ah, uh, you're dead. I got a head. Did you see all the heads I got up here? Look at all them. It's pretty awesome. I'm actually going to run out of room, aren't I? That's all right. We'll start a new row. Whoa. Glad I put these fences up because I'm, I've just about walked off the edge a couple of times. How many heads do I have in here? Um, none. I have these heads here that I can put up still. Okay. Let's go do that. that one. How's that look? Oh yeah, we're getting quite a collection down here. Okay, well, folks, thanks so much for watching. I truly do appreciate you stopping by. Um, if you like this episode, please make sure to leave a like. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Um, it has truly been a great honor and a privilege to have you join me here today. Uh, don't forget to stop by my Patreon page. And folks, until next time, thanks again for watching. We'll catch you on the flip side. See you later. Bye-bye.